Hey guys, let's get right into this week's video, but first, if you missed my last video for my teriyaki pineapple glazed baby back ribs, chow, you know what to do. Watch this one, then go back and check it out. And I'm also making my ham and cheese sliders. They're simply delicious and simply easy. So I can't wait to show you this quick and easy recipe. Let's get to the countdown. guys and welcome back to it adrian thanks it's me adrian today i'm going to show you how to make sliders a ham and cheese slider now these are really easy but they're great if you're having like just a family night a game night just because you need a snack these are great so i can't wait to show you how to make these easy sliders and you know what i'm about to do i'm about to point you down look at the table okay guys so i have here one stick of melted butter and I have just a handful of uh, flat Italian parsley. And I'm just going to roll that up like this. And we're just going to chop that kind of fine like. So I'm going to take my parsley. It's going to go right into our butter. And I'm also going to need some green onion. I have all my vegetables on the side here already rinsed. And I'm just going to use the green of the green onion. Run our knife across them a little bit. It's good, and that also goes into our butter. All right, so we need to get a little seasoning in here. And I have some, you already know, some onion powder. And I have some Mrs. Dash, a teaspoon of dried chives. And bam, that goes in. And I'm gonna get my brush, and we're just gonna stir that I love to use the no salt seasonings and herbs because this is perfect uh, because you know the ham that we're going to use um, has salt and uh, you know lunch meats tend to be a little bit on the salty end at times unless you get the low salt versions and the cheese also has salt so we don't need to add a bunch of extra salt to this so this is nicely mixed and this is what's going to top our ham and cheese slider Next, you're going to need some Hawaiian rolls. I'm just going to cut as evenly as possible right across. Just kind of keep your knife even. Just like that. I'm going to lay that open. And I'm going to get my pan, what these are going to go into. Okay, so our pan is nicely coated with a thin coat of olive oil. I'm going to take the bottom portion of our sliders and just put that like that. And I think I can get a little more. So I have another pack. So I think I'm going to just squeeze in another row there. So I'm just going to do that just like that. What you want to do is just try to fold a piece of ham onto each slider. And I asked for this to be cut really thin. So they really did <laughs> cut this really thin for me. So this is great. Just like that. And I'm just folding and because we want these to be nice little hearty sliders. Guys, just going in with our last couple of pieces here. I think that'll do her. And I have a little Cooper Sharp cheese here. And honestly, you can use any brand that you like, uh, but I, some people use Swiss, um, but I do like the taste of the Cooper Sharp. Okay, so that's our cheese. And next, I like to add some jalapeno peppers. And I'm not going to do them on all because uh, my husband doesn't like the spice, but I do. <laughs> so 
So, uh, but these just give a nice little zip uh, to your slider. So then we're going to add just a little uh, shredded cheese on top of that and just a little just to give it a little some other notes and this, that's just a, me a Mexican cheese blend. All right, and I also have some roasted red peppers and these are just jarred peppers. And we wanna add a little bit of those. To it and I'm, you know, you just wanna kinda break the pieces off a little bit because they're so soft, you can do that. Just break a piece off. And we're gonna add those to our sliders. And guys, and this is our last piece that we're adding. That's just our roasted red pepper. So that looks good so far, right? Mm -hmm. All right, so now we're gonna put our lids on. Just like that. Okay. And now for our mixture. And it's okay if some of the ham and the cheese is peeking out. You want those to get kind of little crispy bits. All right, so we want to take our, our topping and we want to just top that all over the tops of this Hawaiian bread. Tell me that doesn't look good. So these are going to go in the oven for 10 minutes covered. You're going to cover this with foil. And um, after that 10 minutes is up on 350 degrees, we're going to uncover them. And then they're bake uncovered for another 10, 15 minutes until our cheese and everything gets nice and bubbly. Okay, how quick and easy is this? This is a great, um, this is a great addition if you're just trying to have a, either a quick meal or if you're having family and friends over. I'm just trying to get some of that topping down on the sides, just like that. This is perfect game night, family night, just because you want something different. You know, have this with a salad or whatever. It's gonna be good. Okay. So in the oven this goes, 10 minutes covered. A little foil and then 10 minutes uncovered. If it takes any longer, I'll let you know. I'll meet you back. Ham and cheese sliders are done, so we're gonna make a little dippy, dippity dip sauce. <laughs> and I'm just going to use, just getting a plastic fork here. Just going to use some mayonnaise, and I would call that at two tablespoons, two heaping tablespoons. And I just have some yellow mustard. You can use uh, spicy brown mustard too, um, but just a little yellow mustard. Like that. I'm just gonna stir that up, sort of like a Dijonese, <laughs> if you would. And I'm gonna take some of the juice from our jalapeno. Not that much, just a little, just a little, little, little. That's also gonna thin it out. It's gonna give it some flavor, a little heat. I'm gonna take a little bit of our dried chives and add to it like that. 
that is our sauce. There you have it. That's our dipping sauce for our ham and cheese sliders. All right, guys, you know what's next. The taste. Let's cut into these. These actually cook covered for 11 minutes and then another 11 minutes uncovered. Another 10 minutes uncovered, excuse me. Oh, they're so crispy. Can you hear that? They're so crispy and they're hot. <laughs> Give you a peek, see at that. good let's take a little bit of our sauce and put on the side here there you have it let's give these a taste Inga you want to come over and try yes I, I didn't even have to say it twice guys you know this is a real deal let me just give you a close up look at that Got the red pepper peeking out through there. Give a little dippity dip. Oh, you just gonna take my plate? Okay. I'll give it back. Oh, you go. That's the 10 minute timer for our pepperoni sliders, pizza sliders. All right, let's give it a taste. Alexa, stop. And you know, Ice Maker was not gonna be left out of this one. Mm -mm. All right, let me give it a taste. Oh my gosh. Mm -mm -mm. Let me tell you something. <laughs> oh God. Mm. No. We're not eating regular sandwiches no more. <laughs> Can you hear her? <laughs> I hope I haven't got enough. <laughs> mm. She said we're not eating regular sandwiches no more. I hope you give this one a try. Uh-huh. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear her on the sideline. And she is really wild now. <laughs> oh, God. She's so good. What do you want to say? <laughs> you have to try it. You won't regret it. These things are amazing. These sliders. I can only imagine what the pizza ones are going to taste like. There you go. <laughs> All right, you know what's next. We're gonna taste these pizza sliders, but these ones, sure enough hit. Mm. So good. So good. Okay guys, I got the hubby here to try one of these ham and cheese sliders. All right, babe, you ready? You wanna be on camera? No. <laughs> Anything besides mmm? What y'all want to eat? <laughs> and good? Very good. Guess more? Yeah. The pizza ones are out to come out the oven. Mm. <laughs> I'm glad you like them, babe. Mm -mm. What? Full plate, please. That's really good. Got it. Here you are. All right, guys. Babe. What? <laughs> he holding his plate. Oh, well, no. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you want the pepperoni one? You might need something until that comes out. Oh, my God, Robert. Here. Thank you. <laughs> These are really good. Guys, I hope you give these recipes a try. See what your family and friends think. Until next time, sliders out.